Hi, this short tutorial is about the functionality in MeshLab that could be useful in uh, some cases and maybe it's not so well known also because it's a bit like hidden. Okay, so what you're seeing here on screen is a simple model and uh, like uh, most of the models that have been uh, uh, modeled by hand uh, is uh, although if you have a look at the layer dialog you see that it's a single model but if I'm using the selection by the selected compo uh, connected component that is shown in the second uh, video tutorial about selection tools, I can see that uh, even though this is uh, seen as a single model, a single layer, is made by different connected components that have been modeled uh, quite independently with respect to the other. Well, sometimes it could be useful to be able to detach some of the components of a, of a model in order to have them independent one respect to the other. Or in general it could be useful to be able to take a selection and create a new layer from this selection. So just suppose that we want to like to remove this part of the object just by creating a new layer, so making a layer which is independent from the rest of the object. Well after just selecting this, if you right click on the name of the file you will have a list of the operations that you can do on the layer and uh, actually this is the same that you will find on the mesh layer submenu. So coming back and right click we can see that one of the possibilities is the move selected faces to another layer. Essentially this is going to create a new layer that will be made of the faces that have been selected. I can decide if I want to de delete the, se the original selection or keep it as it is. In this case, I want to delete it. So what I end up with is that now the portion of the object that I selected before is now an independent layer with respect to the rest of the object. So if I want, I can like divide this object in the single components in a very fast way. So moving the selection, and this can be done also for points using move selected vertices to another layer, can be useful in order to like decompose uh, objects which were modeled by hand but sometimes it can be useful also for other models like the ones acquired with 3D scanning uh, so if for example I want to remove a part which has higher detail in order to make uh, like an independent layer instead of uh, doing the um, one, one way to do that could be to make the selection, invert the selection um, remove the rest of the object and then save uh, the part that I want to keep. Well, this possibility to move the selection to another layer makes things much faster. So, just take into account that there is this uh, simple to use functionality. Thank you.